Yeah, good afternoon everybody. We're Hi, hello, good afternoon. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> We're uh a big rock. looking down in the the pit there and the big rock that used to be up against the wall there. They actually chipped away. And now they're uh trying to uh, break it up some cuz no way uh <laughs> Are we going to get it out of there otherwise to be able to make it smaller? And I've got some uh, sledgehammers and some uh, rock chisels here that uh, we used on the old well years ago in order to chip the rock and that. And uh, like I said, this is just an, a long, slow, impossible project. But, uh, like I said, it, unless they uh, break it up, there's no way to really be able to get it out of the hole there. But uh, that's a, a big difference from uh, what it was. I'm going to kind of move around here a little bit. Whoop. Get a little bit better view on it. And like I said, there's rock up against this wall, up against the back wall there. And being able to chip away at that. Yeah, this, <laughs> when you're doing this, this is the problem that you run into. And basically just trying to chip a... Uh, small pieces out of it. Well, that's hard work. <laughs> yeah. I know I did some of it in the well when we did the well. And uh, boy, you just sit there for hours and hours and just uh, basically pound on it. Yeah, and like I said, they're, uh, they're only down about half of uh, as deep as we probably got to go here. So uh, it's uh, it's not looking too promising at all that uh, this is going to be something we can do. This is how they do it here. I've seen them dig a, a couple of different wells. And when uh, the group did up at the, the church here that uh, Marife belongs to and that, and uh, wow, the rock they dug out of there, it, pretty incredible what they did. Yep, this is, uh, <laughs> oh boy, this is the old-fashioned, uh, old-fashioned way of doing it. So completely different than uh, the way we do anything, but you can, you can see the, the spot there, and of course the sun is coming in right there, hopefully you can see out of the shadows there. 
and even working uh, where Andoy is, they're trying to clean that up and that and chip stuff out. It's uh, so yeah, we'll have to kind of see what happens here, and you can tell by just how as we've dug deeper how the hard rock kind of here from where they're at right now as we move up the line here of the dirt and walk up here and and see how it uh, <clears throat> kind of gets to the point where here is, is just uh, dirt <laughs> as we're going down deeper actually how it changes and now the whole thing is not just uh, dirt anymore. It's like it's uh, so hard packed that it's actually turning into uh, like rock slivers. So you get uh, so much of the, of the chunks here, like this here. That, that's what they're in right now. It's almost where, where the uh, dirt has compacted itself into rock look at this that's what they're digging in yeah pretty amazing and like i said down between what uh 10 11 feet 11 feet 12 feet right in that area right there and we need to actually get down uh another 10 feet there's boots up here uh but all this here compared to the dirt that we were in before and it's like clay that under compression of where it's at just finally turns into a hard rock yep so yeah that's uh it's a long job and <laughs> i don't know what the outcome is but at the depth they're at right now uh, I think the best explanation is simply that uh, <laughs> probably not going to work we're probably never going to get deep enough here or be able to or it's going to be such a long slow process to uh, run in any type of water and they've run into nothing so far the water table is uh, apparently so low so I'm kind of heading back up uh, towards the house here. I haven't gotten down in there yet and done any digging and that, like I said. <laughs> I did enough digging, digging out our rice fields, carrying dirt, digging and pounding rock in the pond in order to get our pond dug out. Uh, I'm going to let the young guys do this. <laughs> Uh, just uh, and especially in the heat here even though right now again what a blessing that we've got a little bit of a breeze here as you can see in the trees here but the heat is overwhelming the rain that I was hoping for like I said you just didn't feel like it no no such thing again and a little bit of rain we got uh, last night. Gone many, many hours ago. <laughs> so from the back of the camera, I'm going to say goodbye. Everybody take care. Oh, I'll try to be back again soon with uh, some more videos, some more information on uh, what, what we're doing here. And how our life is going here in the Philippines. So <laughs> to everybody, uh, God bless you and uh, have a really good day.